Hi, my name is Porek Foley. I'm a product owner here at Axway. Uh, the purpose of this video is a high level view for some of the changes uh, with API Manager and API Gateway as part of the November release. The primary updates that will be taking place will be the migration from the connected services menu in API Manager and API Gateway to the pre built common portals header, such that there is uniformity across all Axway products. The following, we are going to take a demonstration, uh, a quick overview of the changes that have occurred. So if we are to log in to the old UI, uh, we will give users a view of what they have previously seen in the connected services menu. Quick view, this is what our current users would currently see the connected services menu. However, in the new eye, this is the new UI that our users will see, the common portals header. So if you're familiar with some of our other, of our other products, you will be aware um, of this header. So all the functionality is very much similar. So on the left-hand side, you have the Axway logo, API Gateway Manager, and then you have more or less three or four buttons here on the right-hand side. So left to right, we have the search option. If we just search in Axway, it links in and searches our current knowledge base, our documentation, our discussion forums. So clicking on one of these, you'll see it opens up into a nice new tab. Similarly, in relation to our help button, documentation, developer portal, community portal, support portal, all these options available here. Clicking on any of these again will open it into a new tab. Then we obviously have our platform button. If you're a member, you can obviously log in with your email there. And then finally, we have our user information, which you get here. Similar to the API Gateway Manager, you also have the API Gateway. I've logged in here as an API admin user, and the same functionality is available here also. Um, many of our users do host the API Gateway in a demilitarized zone. As such, there are possible scenarios where users do not want to explain this externally connected information in the application. This, however, is fully configurable um, on the server side. What I'm going to do now is show you the configuration you can update, such that these options are no longer available, what we sometimes refer to as offline mode. So here in the file app.config under API portal app, you have the configuration called connected services menu header offline. You also have the options of search, help, and platform all set to true. Header offline currently set to false. If we actually set this to true and we save and refresh our UI, we'll see uh, hopefully those buttons disappear. Now back in the UI, if we go to refresh, we should stay connected. And we can now see that these buttons have been successfully removed. So that's what many users would be doing in, let's say, a demilitarized zone. Finally, where our users may be in a multi-org uh, account, what we can do here is um, I'll show you a demonstration where we have a user who's in multiple organizations. So I've created this user earlier, test user one. Apologies. So logging in by default, our user will be a member of the first organization that they're configured to. So in this scenario, my test user one is a member of yellow. Um, and they are a general uh, user in this account. However, if I do switch organization, I can say red, where they are an organization administrator. And you can see the fact that the UI dynamically updates such that they have all of the functionality that their role entails. Uh, that comes to the end of our presentation. I uh, hope you enjoy the new release from Axway.